Healthio just presents you this video on A1C glucose relationship. What is the relationship between A1C and blood glucose? Blood glucose testing provides glucose level in blood at that instance, whereas A1C provides a complete picture of mean blood glucose level for past three months. Many people may ask what it means if I have a high A1C and normal blood sugars. On the other hand, some more people may ask what it means if I have healthy A1C and elevated fasting glucose. If you are one among continue watching for a clarification. Relation between A1C and blood glucose test. A1C and glucose level is closely related. However, at many instances, it seems unrelated. Unknowingly, you may have a lot of blood glucose highs and lows, thus end up with an unrelated B1C as compared with meter reading. You are taking glucose reading only at a certain time during a day. What it means if you have high A1C and normal blood sugar? It shows, presently you are on tight diabetes control that your glucose meter indicates. However, you may be badly managed your diabetes for previous weeks or months that has reflected in your A1C. What it means if you have normal A1C and high blood sugar? A normal A1C indicates that your diabetes control was well past one or two months that appeared in your A1C result. However, presently you are in badly controlled diabetes, shown by your glucose meter. When might an HbA1c test consider being not accurate? If your HbA1c is conflicting with home glucose monitoring. For example, the self-monitoring blood glucose levels have been between 300 to 400s and an HbA1c of 6%. The two do not reconcile and there may be a medical condition affecting the test results. Consult your doctor. He she may order CBC test complete blood count to know the cause of false A1C result. Do self-monitoring and HbA1C results not agree? You should consult with your healthcare professional. Confirm whether you are doing the finger prick glucose measurement correctly and accurately. Are both self-monitoring blood glucose and A1C testing necessary? Self-monitoring helps to assess the blood glucose level at that instant. Treat within healthy range and avoid high hyperglycemia or low hypoglycemia. Managing day-to-day -day glucose level helps to achieve optimal A1C some months later. Both A1C and glucose test are interrelated and thus regular blood sugar monitoring is necessary to achieve healthy A1C. Research studies show improving both blood glucose levels and A1C is important for diabetes patients to avoid both micros and macrovascular diabetes complications. If your A1C is in the higher side, do not panic. Put some effort to learn how to lower your A1C level. A1C reading in percentage is meaningless unless converted into an equivalent blood glucose level, for this you say A1C chart and calculator. Subscribe to our video channel for interesting videos and visit healthyogis.com for useful information on diabetes, cholesterol, high and low blood pressure, eye and sleep problems.